Oh, you, I had to make it look juicy for them. But I had to act like these people was always my people. Okay, 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 Rollo fam. Goon admits to snitching. If you don't know, he's an Atlanta rapper who's a self-admitted drug dealer who got rich before the rap. So he was already snitching on himself to get locked up. Then he ended up going to jail and telling on everybody else. Now this video is for the young guys out there who might be dipping and dabbing in the streets. Man, don't do it. Get a job. Go to the warehouse. If you got a felony, construction. Find a way because the streets ain't it. Just listen to the pain of Rollo in his homie's voice as they talk about the snitching. To take acceptance and responsibility for the accusations that are... Ah. Uh, hold on, let me stop you right there. Uh, it ain't it ain't an accu accusation. Uh, it's 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 in black and white, bro. I'm 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 reading your lawyer pleading on your behalf trying to get this record sealed because of this information that you gave. It's you saying that you never said that you didn't do it, but you had me believing for five years that you kept it solid, dog. And in and, and the paperwork, it say that in two months, y'all y'all got locked up in April. In June, June six, you gave a profit, and you gave up information. You gave them folk the code to your phone. And let them review it in your presence. That would the paperwork say. Mm. I, 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 I ain't opposed to that. Shit. Long, you know, the, the, the document that you see is from a prosecution misconduct. But hearing. okay, but so if you saying that you gave them just the phone information because you knew nothing was in the phone, what about this shit on page twelve, line twelve and thirteen, where it say he is cooperating against heroin, methamphetamine. He knows about shootings and the marijuana. That's what this. That's what the transcript say. Okay, I, I, I'm not. I'm not opposition to that. I, he, listen, when they when you go in there, they ask you other questions. I, I, pre, I made my presentation. They started asking other questions. He said when you go in there, they start asking you other questions. Yeah, he's right. I've been brought in one time before. They asked me every question under the sun, stuff that didn't even have to do with what I was there for. But if you a so-called street dude, you are not supposed to answer any questions that could get other people in trouble. Rollo knows this. Everybody knows this. But guess what? The street rules are stupid, and most people want to come home. Uh, you know the code, though. I this, that's what I'm saying. You know the code. You ain't supposed to have no meeting I, with them folks in the first place. I, I, Queen, it, it's, I mean, I, I was presented a, a, a situation that, that other, I just, you just, I just, only reason why you know about this is because of the prosecution of Kondo Henry. All these rap niggas pay that money to get out of there. I, but I, we ain't these rap niggas, though. That what I, that what I, listen, 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 please, uh, please consider this. I, only, I got caught with this shit on the plane, Shake. What the fuck you thought I was going to do? Take your lick. Had a, like, I, shit, I, I, it's just I, I, a week. I, I, well, okay, okay, look, listen, I, remember when, I, before you got locked up, I used to always tell you, hey, uh, don't do this. Hey, uh, don't do that. Hey, uh. I agree with you, Shake. And you used to man, tell me, uh, it's just some weed. So if it's just some weed, why you ain't just go in there and chin up? And guess what? Well, that's easy. It wasn't just weed. A few months after Rollo got locked up, he actually had an over-the-phone interview with an Atlanta radio station. I can't remember which one it was, but I do remember him saying, never get caught with drugs, money, and weapons all in the same spot. So that means before he snitched, he probably was facing a whole lot of time. Man, this shit say... This is what Brian still say. He said... If it comes out on June 6, 2018, that Mr. Davis gave information, and it says that's a lot of information on a lot of people that are well known in this community, that would not be bode well for Mr. Davis or his security interests at all. Like, wh who they yeah. talking about, though? They say well known people uh, in the community, like. Uh, they talk about the, the people who. Uh, you, I had to make it look juicy for them. I had to act like these people was always my people. I ever, I, so but um i mean you tell you told me you told me your logic you know what i'm saying behind why you did what you did so at the very least i could respect you at least come and claim to me but my thing is bro you had me in the blind five years behind this shit like this shit crazy i, I never would never would have expected that from you man like at all you feel me? Man, I, I, bro, look, I can, I'm a man, I'm gonna tell you I'm sorry, bro i'm a muslim first i'm gonna tell you i'm sorry bro but Honestly, I didn't even think it. I mean, I didn't even think this was gonna ever come up. What the hell is like? Why is you mad? I like, why would you be mad? Man, this, this what, this what, this what.
He's mad because he actually believed in the street code. He actually believed Rollo was authentic, but he said Rollo was lying to him for five years. And to the young guys out there, man, the dudes that you hang with will snitch on you. Now, in my book, snitching also means refusing to take a charge. Now, if you come from a background where you have to go out there and get it by any means necessary, I mean any means necessary, to where you or your family might be homeless or starved to death, then this message might not be for you. But if you're someone who got a parent who's working really, really hard to put the food on the table and pay the bills, and at least you have the necessities in life, like you might not have all the new shoes, but at least you have some shoes, stay up out the streets, man. I understand you might not have it all, but you got more than a lot of people. And for the dudes like me growing up who wasn't involved in the streets, but always seemed to find themselves around it, watch who you be around. Everybody ain't good for you. I'm sure some people got locked up with Rollo that had nothing to do with none of that. They was just hanging around thinking everything cool. Man, but go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, and do whatever you gotta do for the rest of the day.